this is another video blog. Today is another cloudy, cold day. I swear, I felt like a baby's daddy. I just want to see my son. Anyway, um, here we are on our way to Seven Springs area. I forget the name of the town officially, but we're on our way out there to a place called the Matterhorn. The Matterhorn Lounge. I'm going to be mixing for um, a band that I've, I've mixed before. Uh, I think the configuration is going to be a little bit different than usual, which is okay. I think I'm looking at um, drums, guitar, bass, saxophone, and vocals. That's it. That's it. We're going to have fun tonight at the Matterhorn. That'll be a good time. I'll take you guys along for a ride. As you saw on the drive, we have a bit of uh, snow that is here on the ground. It was icy, going up and down mountains. I was a little afraid. Well, not afraid, let's just say cautious. You have to be cautious of you driving as well as others driving and mistakes that may happen between the both of you, you know what I mean? But anyway, um, early this morning when I was getting ready to head out, I, uh, Decided to check the fluids on my Astro, which made the trip, by the way. It made the trip, but oh, there was little to no fluids. And when I say fluids, I'm talking transmission fluid and uh, oil. It was down to almost nothing. Um, I'm glad I checked it just to make sure because I might be sitting on the side of the road right now. Well, anyway, there's the lodge right there. I'm gonna go in there and find out exactly where the venue is, where I should actually um, bring in my equipment and all that kind of stuff. And I'll take you on the inside here. Can you tell me where the Matterhorn is? Right down the steps there. Down the steps? Down first level. Okay. Um, I'm the sound guy for a band that's supposed to be playing there. Is there an easy way to get down there, or there are elevate? Oh, <laughs> a substantial amount. But okay. It's a bad order right here. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. The elevator. Um, it's on the hallway on the other side of that door. Okay. And then, when you got... All right, I got into the lodge and I talked to a gentleman who walked me down to the Matterhorn place and then told me where the elevator was. You're going to love this. There is an elevator, though, thank God. Um, I couldn't get into the main venue, the Matterhorn, because right now they're having a wedding party cocktail hour that should be out within the next 45 minutes. So I'm hoping to load and take everything down in an elevator and get prepped within the next 45 minutes so that when they get out, I can actually get in. So we'll see how this works out. <laughs> I'll take you along for this journey. You're going to love this. It's kind of like the shining.
that's all there is. It took me four trips to get it down here. Looks like the, our um, wedding reception is over. So I'm gonna go inside and actually take a look at this stage and the venue to see where we're going to put everything. Here we go, 6.15.
power was fine. There's power all around this place. To have lighting, I would suggest that you take the lighting and point it towards yourself and the dance floor a little bit. There's another bar over there and they flash a lot. Um, other than that, nice little place. Um, the bartender asked me to turn it down, so I went over there with like a, um, a decimal reader to figure out how loud it was over there. After she told me how, after I saw how loud it was, um, I worked it out so that the band sound nice and easy. So the bartender could be able to talk to the customers and the customers can hear when they're exchanging their money over there. It's a big thing. I want to be too loud, but the dance floor picked up real fast and I wound up getting a little bit of feedback up front because they were not really absorbing the sound, but bouncing it right back at uh, the band. But life is good. Life is good. I don't know what to say, but the Matterhorn was live. It started off like there wasn't a lot of people here and my mix was okay. And then a lot of people got here and start crowding the speakers, which gave me high end feedback. I battled it a little bit, but after a while I figured it out. Um, I figured it out as quick as possible and it looked like everybody had a good time on stage. Everybody was comfortable. The band people um, had a good gig and the audience definitely had a great time here tonight. So I appreciate you guys being around here, checking out these crazy videos. Please make sure to subscribe share like give me a comment or something like that because that's how the youtube algorithm works i appreciate you guys and i'll see you at the next gig bye